Hi, I'm Shoshana Stahl reporting for EBTV here at the Community Arts Center where Jax from American Idol will be making her hometown concert. Stay tuned for more. So it turns out that I happen to be the last standing girl of American Idol, which is kind of scary, but it's kind of scary. Only a little scary because I could probably beat up those boys. From the taste of your lips, I'm on a ride. Your toxic, I'm slipping under. Taste of your poison. You know that you're toxic, baby. Oh, I'm in love with what you do. Don't you know that you're toxic, baby? Oh. So, how has music shaped your life? Uh, music is the biggest part of my life. It's universal. It's universal language to speak to everybody. Um, so when you don't, you know, when you don't speak somebody's language, you can still communicate with them through music, and um, it's really just my biggest outlet for expression. I think it's my it's my therapy, big time. It's absolutely unbelievable. Uh, I, I didn't expect it when uh, I came out to the parade to be as amazing as it was. Just people screaming my sister's name, and uh, it just made me so proud. Proudest brother. This is a blast. We're from Long Island. Uh, I'm her uncle, and I couldn't wait to get here. And this is absolutely unbelievable. It really is. How long has she been singing for? From the minute I can remember her being able to open her mouth, she's been singing. She's just uh, always loved it. She's always performed. And uh, this is right up her alley. This is great. I think it's an unbelievable outpouring of support. I mean, when you see all the pictures of the crowds that are here lined the parade route and the number of participants in the parade, um, it's just been unbelievable. East Brunswick has been very supportive of all of our youth. And the fact that uh, Jax has made it this far, you know, really shows, you know, how determined we are as a community when someone does something really, really wonderful to come out and show our support. The parade is starting over at Heavenly Farms and that has uh, members of the fire department, the first aid squad, the high school marching band, uh, the choir is there, uh, and of course Jax. And they're coming down Dunham's Corner Road and then we'll enter into the property here for the concert. In this event, uh, from a public relations standpoint, uh, we are sponsoring the shirts that the band and the choir will be wearing as they march in so they can have an identity because a lot of their uniforms are in being dry cleaned and repaired now. Uh, and this will give the publicity for the East Brunswick Schools and the Education Foundation. So what do you think about the concert tonight? Uh, it's great that uh, someone who has lived in East Brunswick is coming back home to East Brunswick and in turn is really doing something for the town. So the town is very proud of her. So what do you think about Jax coming to East Brunswick? Um, well, I think it's really cool because I live here in East Brunswick too, and it's just really cool. What are you excited for most about tonight? Um, to see her. <laughs> what would you say to Jax if she was watching? I would say that she's very, very famous and I love her. So what's your favorite thing about Jax? Well, she's really good at singing and she's from New Jersey and she's the first one to ever make it this far from New Jersey. And what's your most exciting thing about tonight? Um, to get to see her and how she sings and everything. <laughs> if you could say one thing to Jax, what would you say? Uh, I would say you're amazing and I hope you win. <laughs> and do you think everyone should vote for Jax? Yes. <laughs> so what do you think about the growing support from your community? I didn't see it until now. I mean, I guess I saw it on Twitter, but I mean, this is, um, it's finally tangible and I can hug people and see them in person and like touch their face. <laughs> so um, yeah, it's absolutely insane. I'm so blessed to be here now with everybody around me and I can't thank my hometown enough. It's so crazy. And what do you think about the community sport for Jax? I think it's fantastic. I was uh, at Hammersholt School this morning when she stopped there to uh, see the school that she had gone to. And to say that the response was insane is an understatement. Uh, the, the, the kids really, really loved her and really appreciated it. And I think it's fantastic that everybody's out here showing their support for her. I think that no matter what their, their passion is, whether it's the, the arts, music, or sports, when they see someone uh, somewhat contemporary, maybe a little bit older for our young students, be so successful, pursue a dream, and know that still in America, when you have a dream and you work really hard at it and dedicate your to yourself to it, anything is possible. So I think Jack represents that, that go out there, work hard, and there is success waiting for you. I think you can see here that uh, the community is really involved uh, in this and is really looking forward to tonight, and hopefully they're winning the whole uh, the championship. What are your plans after the show? I'm going on tour. <laughs> 
um, with the top five we're going on tour and then hopefully after that I can get back into the studio and start to write because I miss it a lot. It's, it can only go forward from here I think. Like she has a tour after this and people love her which, I, which also is really amazing for me to see as a brother to how my sister touches these people and I think it's yeah it's just only going to progress from here. The experience for her is just once in a lifetime. I mean everyone out here loves her and uh, you know we're just we're here to support and um, the family's having a blast. As you can imagine, it's uh, been a quite a ride for all of us. And um, I know you probably hear it so many times, a little cliche, but Jax could not have done what she did without all of you. And, and uh, no. so you guys are actually taking the journey with her. And for that, we are eternally grateful to all of you. Another thing, it's my little girl's birthday in a couple of days. So on three, let's, let's give it up. One, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday And there's your next American Idol, folks. <laughs> Again, I'm Shoshana Stahl for This Week in East Brunswick. I hope you enjoyed the homecoming parade and concert. Thanks for watching.